आप सभी को मेरा प्रणाम माई नेम इज अरविंद किन्नौजिया एंड आई वॉमली वेलकम यू ऑन माई चैनल द डेवलप माइंड आई होप यू मस्ट हैव वॉच द पार्ट वन ऑफ दिस वीडियो एंड एंजॉयड एज वेल एज लर्न अ लॉर्ड फ्रॉम दैट और इफ यू हैवेंट वॉच इट सो आई हैव गिविन द लिंक इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल गो वॉच दैट वीडियो देन वॉच दिस actually my main motive is to make this video to tell you that instead of wasting so much of your precious time on reading grammar and all that english rules it's way ahead better to read english books see i'm telling you exactly what i did to improve my english so without wasting any more time let's jump on the chapter in first portion we had seen the author has left his home for hampton and he has reached the richmond city because of running out of money he found a job at the ship so let's move ahead and see what happened next i worked long enough to earn money for my breakfast and it seems to me as i remember it now to have been about the best breakfast that i have ever eaten my work pleased the captain so well that he told me i could continue working for a small amount per day this i was very glad to do i continued working on the vessel for a number of days after buying food with my small wages there was not much left to pay my way to hampton in order to economize in every way possible i continued to sleep under the sidewalk when i had saved enough money with which to reach hampton i thanked the captain of the vessel for his kindness and started again without any unusual occurrence i reached hampton with a surplus of exactly 50 cents with which to begin my education the first sight of the large three story brick school building seemed to have rewarded me for all that i had undergone in order to reach the place the sight of it seemed to give me new life as soon as possible after reaching the grounds of the hampton institute I presented myself before the head teacher for assignment to a class having been so long without proper food a bath and change of clothing I did not of course make a very favorable impression upon her I could see at once that there were doubts in her mind about the wisdom of admitting me as a student for some time she did not refuse to admit me neither did she decide in my favor i continued to linger about her and to impress her in all the ways i could with my worthiness in the meantime i saw her admitting other students and that added greatly to my discomfort i felt deep down in my heart that i could do as well as they if i could only get a chance to show what was in me after some hours had passed The head teacher said to me the adjoining recitation room needs sweeping I was one of the happiest souls on earth the sweeping of that room was my college examination I have passed several examinations since then but I have always felt that this was the best one I ever passed you know what the biggest reason I picked up this chapter because I found that This story is full of inspiration and motivation. So moral of this video is you just start reading any kind of English books instead of wasting so much of your time on reading English grammar and all that English speaking rules. And please keep in mind that never ever jump for any sophisticated or any high level English books. I recommend it would be much better if you go for kid story books and then go for 5 6 9 10 11 12 standard english books i believe this video helped you a lot in your speaking english learning journey my humble request from all of you please support me by hitting the like button below and subscribe my channel i will see you in the next video with an amazing topic
till then pranam